Greetings from Toronto, Ontario, where points are now precious commodities in the race for the playoffs in the Canadian Premier League. York United, four changes from the team that lost to Valor last time out. Babouli and Abatne are suspended. Adisa Di Rosario has returned to TFC2. So in comes Nico Jansopoulos, Roger Thompson in the back. James Merriman makes three changes to the team that tied Atletico Ottawa on Wednesday. In at the back comes uh, George Mukumbua at left back, Adonijah Reed and Gennaro Daniels, the Dutch striker, are recalled up front. Trevine Esprit again. Better for Mane. Daniels and now Stefan Yates on his bike. Trying to feel, find Reed, does so. A square pass across the area. Mane. It took a deflection, it will be a corner. As Manny pulled the trigger, G just got enough on it to deflect it over the crossbar. Only as far as Mukumbiwa, who will return it with interest into the area. Cross the head of Dedic, Mane again, taking on G, Mane. Then wanted to ask for a handball, miss kick from Dedic. Panic stations again inside the York United penalty area. Mukumbiwa and Dedic, and it's going to be the opening goal. They've scored. Wow. It's been coming. Thomas Mio Shiger. Ten minutes gone. Deadlock broken. Pacific have got up ahead of steam and they've got the opening goal against York United. Triton's lead by a goal to nil. Third phase, not even a second phase. They just couldn't do anything there. Gazdorf just celebrated his 20th birthday. Finds Dada Luke. Trying to get away from Esprit. And now Ferrari there to cover, but Dada Luke keeps going. He's such an awkward customer. And finds Reed as well. Can they keep this going? He can shoot Reed. Decides not to. There's the back heel. There's the second goal. Goodness me. It's Sean Young. We haven't played 18 minutes. And Pacific are in complete control. York United are all at sea. And the Tritons lead by two goals to nil. Just ridiculous. The amount of space and time they're being afforded. But fun play there. Daniels, what a little touch. Watch this at the end. And then Young scrubs it in. <laughs> but we talked about the industry. Trying to find his spree unsuccessfully. What a great back heel that is from Janeiro Daniels to set away Manny Aparicio. And Daniels wants it back. He may take it first time. He did take it first time. He might want it back. York United in green jerseys attacking the goal to your right in this second half. And it is Pacific who mount the first attack, first touch for the substitute. Ayman Salouf across the face of goal. My goodness, Daniels couldn't quite connect. Santos cuts in field. This is a little better, or it was for a moment until he ran into Sean Young. Spree takes over, Gagnon Lapare. Pushes it forward, looking for Wright. Wright couldn't get the connection. Got in between the centre backs. I think I'm probably risking a bit more um, or inviting that thought, anyways. You've had nine days off. They should be fresh. They should be able to handle it. Um, it's just an interesting couple of changes, and I didn't think Santos was bad. Nobody's been great. Yates. And there's the header, and there's the third goal. And Manny Aparicio scores against his whole team. Just after the hour mark, he's all smiles. That might be game over. York United nil, Pacific three. And if you want to look at your top player on the team, top player of the game, he's just actually got a goal. Just a cherry on top, and there's still 30 minutes left. Remember, Mukambiwa has had a day off as well. Yates looking to send Reed away, tracked by uh, Josh Hurton behind here. Saved by Jan Sopolos, couldn't quite get his feet sorted out, but he was one-on-one -on -one with the keeper, Josh Hurt. York United desperate for a goal, first touch for Anakubi. No foul, says the referee, it's four on three here. This could be the fourth of the pair, right, Salouf. Thought about it, 
drags it back. Oh. Here's the fourth. David Brajao strokes it in to the far corner. York United all at sea defensively again, and they trail Pacific FC by four goals to nil. It has become a rout. Mr. Salouf with an eighth assist, if I'm not incorrect, and then cool finish by this young man from Portugal. Julian Baldissimo again pushes it to this near side for Grant. Placed up by Salouf. Will Grant get the cross in towards the back post. That's decent, and Di Rosario. It's probably only a consolation, but York United are on the scoreboard. Great work down the right-hand side from Johnny Grant and Di Rosario. I was going to say we'll put a smile on the face of his dad, perhaps not. <laughs> it's 4-1 to Pacific. George and uh, Richie are uh, discussing where they're going afterwards for a cold cup of ice hey, coffee. <laughs> Ongaro, oh, it's a clever ball. And Bojan might be in again here, Josh Hurt. They've scrambled it away. Ten seconds left. They won the game half an hour ago and Adelouk wants to keep the ball in field. As Miriam Marcotte blows her whistle for the final time, and Pacific FC are comfortable winners at York Lions Stadium.